some at a place called Angel Eyes. Ain't that some shit? I don't know, this stuff, uh, bottom feet down, this shit fucking makes it not be down. I don't know what it is. God wouldn't have made him look like that if you didn't want him to look at him. That's the best one. Goodwill. There's some best ones. Not the fuck. This is a badass song. What is this? 810 black rifle my soundtrack to my life man is always on random nigga like, whatever gets me right in the gooch that's a bullseye right if you get hit in the gooch it's a bullseye <laughs> I guess I gotta be a super dickhead. Like the uh, I'm sorry that I'm not sorry type of nigga. Oh, it's been uh, oh, it's been sick. Check this out. Found another cheat code. It's a. Uh, well, I didn't find one. I've been came to the point where I learned about it. The cheat code. It's a uh, spice. Spice, man. That shit is. That shit makes me. For a short amount of time, I could fucking hear every fucking thing. I could hear everybody what they're thinking. bug out they bug out because they're like I don't like spice it makes me fucking hard get paranoid but I'm fucking already centered and shit I'm already fucking I'm out of this world already so uh I could like hear what motherfuckers are saying in their heads <laughs> it's fucking bananas yo Bananas. You about to use the bathroom right yeah, now? Oh, go for it. I'll, I'll wait. Right on. Yeah. My nigga had to use the bathroom. I'm not about to fucking hold him up. 
So I know I'll be. Nigga do me like that, I'm gonna be like, bitch ass nigga. <laughs> Shit, this is the catch mode, huh? Oh, these niggas always got that fucking, always got the hit rocks. Enjoy the silence. I found the day that I had to do the art show, I found this fucking beaded, this bead joint. Like right on the corner, right there on the ground. Everybody keeps asking me, what are you gonna have? Were you, oh, you found another job? What? Like, you motherfuckers just act like you're retarded and you just completely forget what the fuck I've been telling you motherfuckers this whole fucking time, nigga. This is not my job. I am God's avatar, nigga. That's my job. And as his avatar, he told me to get a job at the fucking stupid ass place. Jackson's. By the way, Jackson's, Mr. Jackson, whoever owns it, Mr. Jackson, eat a fat donkey's dick. It's all love, you know what I'm saying? You're a fucking greedy ass bitch, nigga, but that just means you're winning in the game, nigga. But don't worry, nigga, because we're coming to change everything. We're coming to change everything. Greedy ass nigga. Everybody's supposed to be, everybody's supposed to be bald. Motherfuckers hoarding up the fucking money and shit, clogging up the fucking works, nigga. And then you got all the money, nigga. And then there's a gang of niggas without the money. Bitch slap you, nigga. Love. Bitch slap a love. I put in my two week notice and I'm like, fuck, oh, man. I gotta fucking enjoy this for two more weeks to fucking pretend that I fucking enjoy this and I'm happy that they made me a fucking supervisor and and which is all just fucking dumb like stupid like who would be like oh I'm a supervisor I get responsibilities and I gave up more of my life and then not only that but the 15 extra hours that you give me that you're telling me that it's it's a good thing that you take 15 more hours of my fucking of my life that that 15 hours that I worked in overtime that's what Uncle Sam takes from me so basically, man, yeah, not a dummy. I'm awake. Everything that's happening here is not supposed to be happening. And just because I walk, that's just the way things are. It's just it's how it is. We just have to go with how it is. Because you're a coward. Everybody wants the world to change, but nobody wants to fucking do the work. But I do. I do. All by myself. With big dog, but who else is with me? Who else? Look around me. <laughs> Looks like I'm by myself, but Godzilla. Godzilla's standing right over me, nigga, right behind me, nigga, fucking like this. Ready to fucking smash you, niggas. Silence. Hope my nigga didn't have to take a duke. A duke. Get a drop of lumpkin. No, uh, uh, you know I got the two weeks notice. I hope these niggas fire. I think I'm in a uh, straight asshole mode. <laughs> and I'm going to fucking say it. Tell everything how... I'm not going to tell everything in the... The awakened... The awakened... Human loving way. I'm telling it. Awakened. In the awakened... Dickhead way. Like, no, I'm not fucking home. Like, you want me to do what? I want to close down, nigga. No. <laughs> You get clocked out at 6? You want me to work until 6.30? Nah, it's not going to happen. You going to fire me? Please, please do. 
please do. Fireball. Oh, this is. Oh, you mean the fireball? Yeah. No, no, the fireball. Oh, fireball. Yeah. You want to bet? Uh, nah, I'll try it. Please scan your loyalty ID now. I'm going to the coming to the end of my stay just at the sober house. Which is fucking awesome because fuck I can't wait to fucking go on another adventure. Sober house is an adventure, but it's like a fucking super boring one. Super boring. You know. It's cool because I get to fucking. I get to. You know, the shows that I'm supposed to watch, the movies that I watch on my phone, and the videos that I watch. I always get to get my messages from the fucking. You know, the. 
Archangel Michael and fucking uh, play the end of the all those messages from my life family. Uh, you know, uh, it's kind of, when I'm out on the street on my adventures, it's fucking, uh, it's not. Uh, every once in a while, I might get the fucking, uh, be prompted to stop somewhere. To stop, like, at, a uh, somewhere where there's Wi-Fi and, and catch a video or two. And it's always on point. Tells me what's going on, you know, or why I felt a certain way, and why I'm doing a certain thing. Uh, you can't do this with anybody else. You can't have a partner. You know what I'm saying? I always say I would like to fucking. I kind of felt like I wanted to like. It'd be cool if I had another person that was like we were on the same shit and we could you know, talk about this shit together. But then, now I'm like. There is no room for anybody else. When it's when you're what do you call it? Saved, reborn, you fucking surrender. You know, and you let Jesus come in you. Christ conscious come Christ come into you. God come into you. There's no fucking room for anybody else. There's no room for anybody else. Sorry. Uh, it sounds fucking selfish, but that's what he said. It has to be and what it's supposed to be. Going outside of him to... Going outside of God to... To look or for love or acceptance... Doesn't work. It doesn't work. Look all you want. Look all you want. All you're going to do is keep bumping your head on your ass. Pain, pain, pain and suffering is all over your... It's all you get. Gay ass, think you're a gay ass human still, so you can fucking ass yeah, now. You're never gonna get out of here. It's just a loop. A loop of purgatory. Searching for something that has been there the whole time. Searching for something that's been there the whole time. Love yourself. You're God. Therefore, God is love. God's love. God's God's love. Fucking looking outside of yourself, thinking that you're a separate entity. You're separate from God, and it's not even the case. But you're supposed to be that way because this is a game that this is a game that God's play. What else are we gonna do, bugger? Something. This is something so awesome. The the dream, the thing that God said He was gonna give you. Ooh, my song. It's just in sync that I promise. Ooh. In sync. Justin Timberlake is my nigga. There's a. <laughs> Since I got supply eyes. <laughs> yeah. That nigga is just. Man. I love that guy. <coughs> How they try to throw us off is to say. It's to make up this bullshit, say, say that there's only one true God. It's the God that, whatever religion, what God we say it is, that's the one true God. Anything other than that, you're worshiping a false idol. God doesn't like that. <laughs> God doesn't like that. God doesn't like you to like something that He created because God is everything, and. God created all things. There was not one thing that was created that was not created by him. So do not like the things God created. Do not like the beings that God created and the, the pleasure they bring to you from their words, their songs, their singing, their, their beautiful voices, their fucking talented fucking uh, art, their, their way with words, their fucking... Uh, the way they can act in movies and portray different characters. Don't, yeah, don't like that. Don't like that at all. Don't, you know, <laughs> them niggas got you, got y'all motherfuckers wrapped. They don't got you wrapped around their fingers. They got you wrapped around their tiny little pink penises. <laughs> little dick rings. All you fuckers. Don't like a, don't worship a false idol. Nigga. 
everything and everybody is God and everything is created through God. And all, all things that people create are him creating through them. Why would God not want you to like what he's, what he's done, what he creates? He doesn't fucking make any fucking sense. You guys are stupid. You're reading out of a fucking storybook. You're reading a storybook for dummies. For that stupid, stupid idiot, dumb babies who only would believe some dumb shit like that. Stupid, dumb, retarded babies. You know the babies that have that were grown and the niggas don't even have a head. It's just a fucking, it's just two eyes and a nose and a mouth. Nigga, that's 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 what you motherfuckers are. That's a, you're that's what, how much brain power you got, nigga. You don't even have a brain, nigga. It's just a fucking eyes, nose, and a mouth. <laughs> fucking like a look like you're on the end of a fucking fingertip. Fire bizzles. I'm going to watch Hellboy and then I'll have to drink fireballs. With the little devil on it, blowing up. Knock, knock, let the devil in. Oh, no, I like that dude, was Enzo One. Man, that's just tight. Nigga <laughs> says, says, from the ashes of rock. <laughs> You rise like a phoenix. He said, bitch, I'm reincarnated. <laughs> and you know, in the beginning with that nigga, you know, if you could even hear in the fifth dimension and hear what he's saying, he'd be saying, like when he fucking woke up, the nigga was like, same shit that I have, that I was fucking saying, what kind of ass backwards bullshit is this? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, <laughs> oh, he's cold. Back with bullshit is this God is a trip man. That nigga is funny as fuck Funny as fuck Nigga cause everything is fucking backwards And there's no way you can unlock your fucking You can't fucking just There's, a, there's not any words like somebody who asked me today Cause I was talking to somebody They were like what are you doing You trying to wake him up No I said nigga I can't wake nobody up Nigga I ain't nobody's fucking I ain't nobody's fucking savior, nigga. They gotta save their fucking self, nigga. Just like Morpheus said, nigga, nobody can be told what the Matrix is. They have to see it for themselves. Ooh. No, it's funny too, the, like, through, going through all this shit. The funniest thing that I heard in my third dimension life was, uh, there's one thing that God can't do. Tell me, what, what is the one thing that God can't do? He can't lie. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I fucking wanted to fucking stick a st st fucking stick a dildo on my own ass for that faggot ass shit. <laughs> Nigga, that's some gay ass shit right there. Nigga, he's God. He can do whatever the fuck he wants. <laughs> can't lie. Nigga, the fuck? God can do whatever the fuck he wants. Nigga, he can't. You can't say what he can and can't do. <laughs> if I was to think of everything that I've been told everything that I've been told and guided to do ever since the beginning and I was uh, thinking in the tiny tiny little not even a full peanut just a little half of a piece of a corner of a peanut of a brain God lied every fucking damn time <laughs> you lie every fucking time. <sighs> you don't understand him. You don't understand God. You don't know God, motherfucker. How do you know him? From reading a fucking... Reading a bunch of different interpretations and then coming up with your own interpretation out of a fucking... Out of a stupid, tiny-ass, dumb book called the Bible. Basic instructions before leaving Earth. 
nigga, like, oh, fuck shit on the bike, nigga, fuck that shit. Bible means nothing until you wake up. It means nothing until you wake up. And then when you wake up, then it means nothing. Everything that it's supposed to mean, you already have it. And it, uh, your, what your interpretations of was of it, you had to have purged all that shit already. Start out blank slate. Blank slate, just like a brand new newborn baby. God can't put new wine into old fucking funky ass wineskins, nigga. They'll bust. You have to be reborn. You can't get new information. You cannot get this information, the real truth information, with your old beliefs still inside you. Any of them. Even your fucking, even the belief that you're human, even the belief that your name is a uh, fuckboy or whatever the fuck your faggot ass name is, can't go in with any of that. Blank slate. And I think, though, when you need to fucking reach the highest ascension, you must purge everything and everybody you love from your from your heart. All of it has to go. All of it has to go. And uh, that's why a lot of motherfuckers ain't going to make it. God said, do not store up your treasure, you little dickweed, because you can't take that shit with you. Yeah. So you spend your time fucking hoarding your money, fucking buying houses, buying this, buying that, fucking over other people, basically, you know what I'm saying? Because you fucking hoarding all the fucking money, you're hoarding all the energy, you know what I'm saying? The energy needs to flow. If you have all the fucking money, nigga, then, then who doesn't have it? None of this shit with you. You can't. The people that you think are your kids, the people you think that are your parents, the people you think that are your wives and husbands, they ain't going with you, nigga. Because they're not real. This is not real. This is a dream. This is a dream, a game, uh, fun. This is something fun. And the fun, it's been fun, but the fun, nigga, is yet to come, nigga. Fun is yet to come. I was gonna tell motherfuckers, I started to fucking tell them uh, what about the fucking, you know, what the end is gonna be. And then, uh, and then he told me you just shut my mouth. <laughs> Not that I went off of the path and started saying something I wasn't because it couldn't happen any other way. What I, what I said, the little bit I did say about it was supposed to be said. Then he told me to shut up. Now I'm supposed to shut the fuck up about it. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be so fun. Especially when everybody knows that, you know, starts is awake and they know that this isn't real and death isn't real and you know, it's fucking it's just a game. You cannot so it's just a game. How know what's gonna make you lose the game? Just like on all the zombie movies. On all the movies about fucking shit, what, what, how did these motherfuckers end up fucking dying? They end up dying by trying to hold on to shit. They die by holding on to shit, like uh, trying to keep shit for themselves. And, uh, and then by fucking being bad to other fucking, to other beings, by being dickheads to them and fucking killing them, taking their shit, or uh, or acting like they're cool with them and and they're nice, and then they steal their shit and take off, so they keep their shit for themselves. And you know, motherfuckers that are trying to keep shit, and the motherfuckers, you know what? What else is badass? That nigga, this shit is about motherfucking dying, nigga, for others. This is about dying for others, which is, which makes sense now because 
as I was uh, awakening in an early part, like I was like, why is every fucking movie that I watch, it doesn't matter, like Battle LA, fucking, like all kinds of movies, every movie that I watch, the only thing that sticks out to me is that there are people that give their lives for other people that they don't know, for different races, male, female, motherfuckers are just mad, it don't even fucking matter, they're giving their fucking lives, and then they just die, and then that's it, they die, they fucking save somebody, and they die, then you don't, you know, you don't hear nothing else about them, you know, when you're, when you're, I'm in the third dimension, I used to watch those movies, it's like, I, I used to be like, what a dumb fuck, man, I wouldn't have saved that fucking, man, fuck those bitches, <laughs> Nigga, oh, fuck that. That nigga got, man, he saved all those, he saved that fucking, that coward ass bitch. And now the nigga's getting eaten by zombies. That's what he gets. Now he's gonna die slow getting eaten up by fucking zombies that are eating him to death. And then the bitch that he saved didn't even try to help him. Did she just fucking, she just dipped out. Didn't even say thank you or nothing. Fuck them. That's what I used to think. And then uh, as I'm waking and all I see is, this is like a bunch of fucking Jesuses. Like everybody's just a bunch of Jesuses. Like he saved something, he's Jesus, he's saying he's Jesus. Jesus fucking saved a bunch of motherfuckers he didn't fucking know. You know what I'm saying? Went through all that shit, got fucked up. And not only that, it's the same as there's a bunch of motherfuckers that don't appreciate his ass for what he did. You know what I'm saying? Didn't know motherfuckers ain't say thank you or none of that shit. Nigga, all they do is do everything that they're not supposed to do. Imitate Jesus. Imitate Jesus. Don't judge. You know, love your neighbor as yourself. Um, you know, all that fucking, all that jazz. And uh, but if you're not a, if you're not a Jehovah's Witness, I'm fucking you're fucking dead. They're all dead. Yeah, they're not a Jehovah. They didn't take the truth, so they're dead. They're dead. But God gives us every breath, and God writes. God has a plan, and no nobody or nothing can fuck up God's plan. But, obviously, he wrote that it was a losing game. It was a losing game from the beginning because then God wrote everybody's path that isn't a Jehovah's Witness. They were pretty much, they were fucked already. There was no, no hope for them. And everybody who that luckily got picked to be a Jehovah's Witness, luckily, now those are God loves them more than everybody, huh? God loves, but, but, God's love is unconditional, but he's gonna kill all these motherfuckers because they didn't want to listen to some stupid ass shit that Jehovah's Witnesses say, if you don't listen, you're gonna die. Well, that's it. Put them on the do not return call list, they're dead. <laughs> oh, hell no. Big dog is a fool, man. He made this shit fucking crazy. He made this fucking world. This is fucking, it's so sick, though. It's so sick. I wonder what we're, if we're, like, in goggles, like, in, if we're, like, uh, in an arcade or some shit. Or, like, where are we at for real? You know, I can't wait to fucking go home and if I can remember everything, but. I know I'm on a ship. My body's on a ship, but. And I kind of remember I was laying down, and they did say that the fucking, uh, the ones that are watching, that they fucking, uh, you know, that they kiss my feet when I'm, uh, you know, you know, my other body, you know what I'm saying, when they see me do shit, you know, that, like, act the motherfucking fool, or go against what everybody, the material world tells me, go against all what it, what humans call logical or rational fucking thought just to follow signs from uh from big dog and communication that just seems like nothing to nobody else it seems like you know what somebody told me like you just seem like you're an addict or you just seem like you know i did too many drugs and you you know your brain's a little messed up or Believe things that ain't that are make believe and shit. You know what I think about you? Nothing. 
Know what I think about everybody else? Nothing. <laughs> nothing. None, none, yeah, nothing. I don't have no brain power or anything. No time, no no thought. No anything goes into it. To like, like, oh, yeah, man. This motherfucker. Nah. None at all. None at all. It's just fucking not in. It's not. It doesn't seem like something that. To me, it's uh, pointless. Like, I'm worried about my. Yeah. I miss my kid, man. I hope she's okay. I'm worried about her, dude. <laughs> fuck it. What the fuck do I have to worry about fucking somebody else's cat, nigga? I'm doing what I'm fucking supposed to do, nigga. And me doing what I'm supposed to do, all I know is that she's gonna be straight if I do. Nigga. There. That's it. Well, I don't have any more fucking word in the world. I don't have any more word in the world. There's not no thought, and everything that's going to happen should happen. Do you love me, Dollar Tacos? Do you? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm not saying that I don't care about my kid. My kid is straight. You know what I'm saying? My kid is straight. The character of my kid is straight. <coughs> Whoever plays my kid is on the ship with me. You know, where my body is, my kid, whoever plays my kid is there with me. Whether that's my kid up there or not. Hey, what do I gotta what, what am I gonna think to try to figure out some shit for? What am I gonna do? Start get a calculator, start adding up fucking and crunching numbers and and grab some books and start researching so I can figure this shit on out. <laughs> I don't give a fuck, nigga. You know what I'm thinking right now? There's a yield sign. I'm walking on some bricks. I'm almost to the thing. Oh, shit, a building says cupcakes on it. That's what I'm thinking. And I'm thinking that I fucking love this song. And my nigga is my soundtrack of my life. Shoddy Horror X. Troy Boy. Do you love me? <laughs> I should say. Oh, my God. My tooth. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Ow. Like, pretty much all my back teeth are fucking breaking into pieces. You know, like fucking jagged little broken pieces of glass in the back of my fucking mouth. That always hurt, but I'm just so used to it. Uh. Hmm. Oh shit! That's a. Uh, that's the owner of Carla Vista's truck right there. That's a. Uh, Tom Faye, Big Boss Hogalini. Do you love me? Do you love me? Do you love me? When I hear that shit, that's all I hear is, uh, I hear him ask, you know, and then there's a beat that makes my makes my feet want to start just fucking going fucking going crazy, you know. Makes my body fucking bop side to side, and my head fucking just wants to fucking start head banging. That's God's love, and it's shit. My hair stand up all over my fucking all over my body, and I feel like I'm getting fucking electrocuted with with love. Big ass moon. Oh, 
Oh shit, these are apartments here. That would be sick to live at one of these motherfuckers. I go to the movies whenever the fuck I want it. Oh, those are, those are. Town Commons, that's sick. That'd be dope. I go to the movies in my motherfucking jammies, nigga. My jam jams. Then just go home. Now, he likes me, so he says the song is I Think You Freaky. I think you freaky and I like you a lot. Man, Diane Wood. Loving doesn't mean you have to worship. Worshiping. Worshiping is stupid. Worshiping is stupid. You can do it if you want. You have free will. You know what I'm saying? If it makes you happy, worship away. Worship away. Throw your little fucking rags or your little fucking rugs or whatever on the ground. Bow down at a certain time and fucking wipe your feet off and and don't touch your dick with your left hand and <laughs> sit down when you piss. Whatever the fuck you do. Who gives a fuck? You know what I'm saying? If you like it, you know, enjoy your life. You know what I'm saying? Nigga doesn't require it. He just requires you to enjoy your life and fucking be grateful. <sighs> All Diane Wood and them niggas talk about is Jesus Christ and God. But everybody doesn't even fucking realize it. I know what made my tooth hurt is this fucking cherry limeade, son of a bitch. But I'm a sucker for pain. I just splashed it all over my motherfucking leg. Awesome. Awesome. Jump, jump, motherfucker, jump. Oh, God thinks. He thinks I'm freaky and he, lo he likes me a lot. Some most of the time the songs go two ways because it could be him to me and then it switches the feeling of me to him. But the feeling of wanting to me to start fucking pop locking and shit in the middle of the street. They got that video with the Mexican dude and he's like, I love you, God. And the niggas pop locking and shit, the Mexican cat. And motherfuckers, they think that shit is. You know, like some people, they might clown because it's funny, but I bet you the motherfuckers that know, they, they don't, they, they're laughing because they love that nigga. They feel him. And I feel him. I'm like, I know exactly how that motherfucker feels. Exactly how he's doing. That's exactly how I feel. You know, like. Okay, let's see here. Hellboy. What the time is it? Oh my god, and I'm at 7.30, and I just made it at 7.39. Which means I got enough time to find a sniper. And, uh... I don't like people like to fucking, uh... Clean the ashtrays, like, when it gets one cigarette in it. And I don't like it. One bit. All I need is one sniper. Damn it, somebody peed on that one. Oh, this is gonna be awesome, man. I'm, not, I'm in like a different type of feeling right now. <laughs> like, uh, I'm on an uh, open dimension, like, uh. Oh, hell yeah, there was one right where I just walked up by, nigga. Ooh, thank you. Oh, it's tricky, huh? Olsen, my nigga. He looks out for a nigga all the time. Oh my demons. What do you say? All oh, my demons. Angels versus demons. This is gonna be badass. So, 
I gotta go. And, uh, me and Big Dog are gonna go watch a movie together. And when you wake up, then you know what I'm talking about. Everything, even all the movies you ever watched before. The ones you watch a million times, you know, from front to back, nigga, they're gonna be brand fucking new, nigga, when you wake up. Brand new, because you're gonna be like, what the fuck? This isn't even the same at all. Like, same words, but not the same words, not the same meaning. The words have different meanings, different everything, different feelings. You don't feel so good, you're gonna try to suck your own dick, nigga. It's a little bit far, but. Yeah, you're gonna try to suck your own dick, nigga. Oh, glory to big dog. I'll see y'all niggas after we get out this flick.